Turn it up, mm. turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. And welcome back to my channel. It's your host Arlette, and we are back with another episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. And we've got some single men lined up. Make some noise, guys. Okay, okay. <laughs> so we are going to be bringing out some single women once they come around this corner one by one. If you're feeling her, you know, outfits on point, makeup on fleek, whatever it is, do not pop your balloon. However, if there's anything like maybe she says something that's a red flag to you or you just cannot see yourself dating her, go ahead and pop that balloon and I'll go over to a few of you, see why you ended up popping. Are we ready? Okay. All right, let's, let, let's, let's take a look at the lineup really quick man let's take a look at the lineup i probably won't be able to zoom in but okay we got country wayne and <laughs> nah, he's not country wayne but we got our guy to the far left got a country boy uh hat or, or cowboy hat whatever you want to call it you know with with the uh muscles out yeah y'all know he got to show the muscles and then he has the black tee with the with the jeans i you know i don't know why he dressed like that but that's what he wanted to wear. Um, we have Love Live Serve, the guy from Love Live Serve. I don't remember his name, but I know he got his own YouTube channel, so he does the social media thing. Um, <clears throat> and then we got our guy in the all black, all right? And then with the, the guy with the blue and, like, vanilla cream pants or whatever. All these guys are, look like they're pretty tall. All these guys look at least 5'10 and above, at least. Maybe the guy, you know, with the black shirt at the end might be like 5'9", but they're pushing really good uh, height right now. I, th I think I think they're not as I don't know. We'll find out. But let's hop into it. Let's see. All right. So with that being said, let's go ahead and bring out our first single lady. Hello, welcome in. Oh, What's your whoa. name? My name is Nucci. <laughs> hey, Nucci, how old are you? No, no, no. She ain't dressed for the date. She's dressed for, like, why is she looking like she about to go to the clubs? Everything is tight up. Hold on, man. Everything is tight up, man. Show, hey, we got to, I, I can't even blow out her Instagram name. Now people going to go ahead and check out her Instagram name. Because, I'm 25. I'll be 26 She's 25. Okay. And artist as well as a behavioral health tech and i'm also a stripper <laughs> oh see okay, it makes no. sense what kind of artist no, are no. you hey 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 my god popped immediately he didn't have, he didn't have he didn't skip a beat she said i am a stripper pop hey that makes sense now the way that she's dressed she's a little bit like you know everything is too like out you know she's used to that she's comfortable no wonder no wonder yeah I like my guy popping though, like that, like he knows what he's looking for, and that's not it. Let's go. Yeah, I rap. Oh, mm -hmm. okay, all right. So, any thing we should be looking out for? Anything soon? Yes, actually, I dropped a song yesterday, so go ahead and check that out, you guys. Okay. No. Showgirl Nucci on YouTube and Instagram. All right. She well, seems we'll like she's about out. like upper thirties. <laughs> what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I like to write music. Uh, I love movies. Like, I really like, I grew up watching movies. Like, my grandma would sneak us into the movies. <laughs> like, we would pay for one, go see another one, we would okay. pay for it. So, yeah. <laughs> love movies. Um, I love to hike. I like to work out as well. Um, anybody nah, that knows lying. me knows that when I was, like, heavily into my working out, like, regimen, mm -hmm. I was working out, like, five, six days a week. I got really small. Plumped up a little bit, but I like mm -hmm. myself both sizes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um... Just security within yourself, confidence, um, a guy that has like goals mm -hmm. um, and actually like doing something to achieve them. Yeah. Okay. Now, what are some deal breakers? Ooh, deal breakers. Um, a guy like if you if you've met me, if you've been around me, humbly, I do get attention. So like if you know that about me and you want to pursue me, mm -hmm. then that's definitely something like if you tend to get insecure about the attention that I get. That's something that would make me like kind of stray away from you. Mm, okay. Uh -huh. Listen, it's because like the way you dress, obviously, if she dressed like this on the daily basis, of course, of course, <laughs> of course, most guys are going to, you know, check her out and all that extra stuff because she got everything out. Like she's making 
She's she's luring people to look at her. So what are you talking about? If 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 I get that attention, like bro, you could you could definitely cover up. It's obvious. It's obvious, guys. Just 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 point it out. All right. So we did get um a couple pop balloons. Hey, the cowboy like what he see though. Look at them. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right. Let's start with your name and age. Uh, I'm Trey. I'm 25. And Trey, what do you do? Uh, I'm a development project manager at a tech company. Okay. And so why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, just a profession. Stripper. That's not my preference. Nothing wrong with you. No, honestly, I thought it was going to be more people that would pop. So I understand. <laughs> yeah, man. Okay. yeah, that's it. Got it. All right. Now, is uh, he someone that's your type? Um, you're dressed very well. Great smile. Just um, if we're going off everyday life, I probably wouldn't entertain. Yeah. Nothing against you. You're very handsome. No, thank you. I appreciate it. Now, is there something there that's making you say you wouldn't entertain him? Um, the way he's built, she like him better. I think I just... I already know it. It's I okay. think I just like a more, like, brolicky guy. Like, See, a little bit I more, like, like... It's mm, obvious. Like, you know? It's, it's <laughs> obvious, man. It's simple. No, not that saying, like, no, you're, you're not that. You're but playing. just, for playing. me, I'm you're a big good. girl, so... I understand. Yeah. Let's go. All right, cool. Thank you. And let's go he down said, over praise here. God. I'm you're a good. big girl, so... I understand. Yeah. Let's go. All right, cool. Thank you. And let's go down He said, praise God. Your name and age. Uh, yeah, my name is Key. I'm 28. And Key, what do you do? Uh, I own a trucking business. <laughs> very cool. Now, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, just a profession. Same thing. Uh, very yeah, pretty man. girl. Thank just you. We don't want, yeah, that's it. We don't want our wife. Hot. Hot. <laughs> you good. Okay. And now, is Key someone that's your type? Love this is your live. complexion. Like, this that was definitely right the first thing that caught my eye when I walked out here. Appreciate um, it. Love the waves as well. Um, I probably would entertain you if you approached me. So, yeah. Mm. Okay. okay. Cool. Okay, cool. okay, because he do have a little bit more All height right. on him, so, so she probably like that. We do have quite a few balloons like left and popped. Them. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question, help you narrow it down. Ooh. Um, damn, I didn't really think about this. Oh, girl. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, do any of you guys have children? You are, do? Are kids a deal breaker for you? Yeah. Okay. So I'm sorry. Let's head on over here. Dang it, my glasses. Let's start with your name and age. Right, my name is John. I'm 31. John, what do you do? Uh, I'm an area space tech and uh, I do content. So. Okay, got it. So she did pop on you for the kids. Um, why did you have your balloon? Okay, got it. Trying to fill her up. Now, I know the kids is a deal breaker, but is he someone that's your type? Um, you're so cute. Like, let me just say that you're <laughs> no. like really cute, but like. If I'm gonna be with somebody, I need somebody that's like fine to me. Like you fine to to a lot of girls, I'm sure. But yeah. to me, like <laughs> look cute. A cowboy. I love your dreads. <laughs> I like the way you're dressed. Yeah. That's cool. I was corrected. Okay. <laughs> All righty. So everyone else has no kids. Any other questions? Um <laughs> This is dumb, but like I do want to know your guys' signs. Oh okay. my gosh, man. <laughs> Love this surf, love this surf, pop this joint immediately. Yeah, with the with the science thing, man. Why do people care about that so hard? Me as a believer, I don't give a dog on about no what's your sign. That don't matter to me. That's not the I don't care. Like what the heck is wrong with people when it comes to that? Hey, look at the cowboy laughing. The cowboy. The buff cowboy laughing, man. I think she might end up going with him. But we have to see, cause because if he's not like, if he don't have a, a certain occupation, I think she's gonna drop him. But I think he, she is. I think he's her type, though. I think she's gonna like how, I think she likes him, as far as Bill and stuff like that. But we'll see if he has the gift of gab, though. He hasn't had the gift of gab. If you don't have it, and if you, if you don't have the certain occupation where she's comfortable with, she's gonna drop him. Okay, I wasn't still... gonna pop you based off your sign. I just want to know. <laughs> we'll start Dang. here with your name and age. Uh, my name is Dante. I'm 25. Okay. Dante, what Dante? do you do? Uh, I'm a famous adult uh, entertainer and also oh, a uh, yo. YouTuber as well. Okay, got so, yeah. it. Oh, so, wow, to answer a question, bro. what's your sign? Yo, I'm a Sagittarius. Wow. Okay, a I like Sag. Sag. Yeah. Okay. Nah, he's getting dropped. We'll come back. He's name and age. Name no wonder why he has a hoarse voice, man. What he be li What he be doing with his? I don't really want to know. But no wonder why he got a raspy voice. That's not natural rasp. That's that um, that's that induced self-induced rasp right there, bro. Like he's an adult entertainer. Nah, he his his yeah, he done been through some things. 
and 26. And what do you do? And I own a online business, so yeah. Okay. And what's your sign? Yeah, this is live. This is live. Okay, I like Cancer. You guys are very like emotionally okay. intelligent and like just like intuitive when it comes to emotions. Oh, for sure, yeah. I like that. Yeah, and you guys like really make people feel comfortable. Like no sign, I feel like mm -hmm. is better at doing that than a Cancer. So yeah, that's how it is. For I sure. like that. Yeah. Name and age? Chris, twenty-seven. And Chris, what do you do? I got a couple jobs. Uh, I'm a realtor first, mm -hmm. and then I work at a community center with kids, and then I work at to nonprofits. Okay. Yeah. Right. I like that. What's your sign? Scorpio. I have a love hate <laughs> relationship with you guys. Like, I love you guys, but you guys are toxic. See, <laughs> look at that, man. All that BS. Uh, whatever, going on one of these shows? No, I'm married now. You, hey, your man is locked down. Your man is locked down out here. Yeah, we went to Mary Squad down. I, I would not go on one of these shows at this point. Wait <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> yeah, at least you know. <laughs> Thank you. And we did get a... Uh, Peggy said that's that Hollywood sacrifice rasp. Hey. Pop, let's head on back this way. Your name and age? My name's Ryan. I'm 26. And Ryan, what do you do? I own uh, two different media companies. Okay. So you did end up popping your balloon when she asked, what's your sign? What's up? You, what's Christian? going on? Um, you yeah, it's just in. the sign thing. I just never got into that. Mm. And I don't even like speaking about that. Mm -hmm. Okay. I understand. Like, <laughs> a lot of guys are like that, so I don't fault you for that. All good. <laughs> All right. So prior to her asking about signs, you did have your balloon unpopped. Why so? I kind of wanted to hear her out. The profession thing did kind of take me through a little loop, but I was I was still open. Um, yeah. So, and, and she's thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. So. Hey, 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 listen, 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 listen. Like That's why he was open. He was open because she, everything she's got on is... Showing where her openings are. Paul, well, not pause, but yeah, man. Because she has everything open. That's why he was open, of course. But the stripper thing, you know, he can't He, he can't really rock with it. He, he can't really rock with it. He didn't want to say it, but I know he didn't want to you know, rock with that. Because <clears throat> I, I bet he's been to some strip clubs. And at this point, you know, he knows what, you know, what goes on. So he's not really rocking with the stripper thing. He's, he's, he's indeed like... Yeah, but when it comes to the strippers, ah, I am definitely not gonna rock with it. But he, of course, he's not gonna say it on on a show, you know. Like that. So, <laughs> so I was like, I was like, no, we can. Uh, I just want to hear what she had to say. Okay. Oh, we can what? No, now, is he was gonna say something freaky. Saying? No, because. You're just a smidgen too light skin for me. I know uh. I'm light skin as well. <laughs> Why no? He did extra. Why he? Like for me i know i'm light skin as well nah he did that but oh shit i like him a little bit brown to dark skin yeah. hey cool. cowboy yeah. got her man all right cool thank you let's go over here why'd you end up popping man I, sh I'm, I think i'm light skin i don't know like you feel you know, me like him. <laughs> light, light, light. you should have gave yourself a chance hey i mean look i didn't know you should have been clear on me you know? <laughs> <laughs> but it's all good. Well, I did say brown to light skin. To brown me, light, you're, I mean, you well, are kind of like on the cusp of light. Yeah, yeah. But you are, to me, you have a little bit more melanin. Okay, for know. sure. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Damn, okay. So, but you want that balloon back or something? Right. Look at him licking his lips. Yo, what are you doing, bro? Why are you salivating in front of everybody? And look at Love Little Surf laughing in the background. <laughs> You know you want your balloon back, man. Why you biting your lip like that? Yeah. yeah. Biting your lip. Look at him. Balloon back. Yeah. It's freaky behind. Yeah. Come on. This Come guy on. is yes, freaky, yeah. man. <laughs> okay, hey, we'll be back for you then. He ended up popping as well. What's going on? Same thing, you know. I'm light skinned, as everybody can see. She said brown skin to dark skin. Maybe I should have specified like like light bright right. Type shit. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Like There's nothing wrong with light brights at all. Like yeah, all yeah, complexions yeah. are beautiful. It's just a preference. Yeah, no, I feel yeah. you. But you, yeah, no, you're you, damn near the same color. Yeah, you're the same color. I've been light skinned my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm only dark as we in Arizona right now. Okay, all right. So, do you want him to get? Well, I don't know. I mean, it's up to him. It's up to you. You want the balloon back or no? Shit. I think I'm a just. I just want to see what else. Out there. <laughs> okay. Okay. No problem. All right. So, is he someone bad. that is your type? Um. I love the way you're dressed. Appreciate it. Very handsome. I probably wouldn't in the real world 
entertain. Okay. But, uh, okay. So prior to her saying the whole light skin thing, why'd you have your balloon unpopped? Oh, well, she cold. Okay. <clears throat> My boy's gone. <laughs> yeah, but she cold. What's going on? Okay. Thank you. It's thick as hell, yeah. <laughs> I tell you, hey, hey, everybody and we did get a pop is. down here. <laughs> All right, your name and age? How you doing? My name is Nati. Okay. I'm 25. Okay. And Nati, sorry, what wait, you... what's your name? Nati. Nati. Nati? Yeah. Okay. Ethiopian name. Okay. okay. Like and that. what do you do? I'm a project engineer for a general contractor, full time, and then do a little freelance estimating on the side. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So why'd you end up uh, popping your balloon? Thing. Well, first I'm an I'm an Aries, <clears throat> but, that, um, but yeah, when people ask me about my sign, I feel like they're making a lot of assumptions about the sign. To be honest, I don't believe in that at all. Yeah. Um, but you're cool though, you know. You're pretty, and thank you. you. Know, I think we'd be good friends, but. Yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> and honestly, let me just elaborate on, like, the Zodiac question. Like, I would never cancel somebody because of their Zodiac sign. Like, that's dumb. But, like, I do, like, I'm a Virgo. So, like, a lot of the things that they say about Virgos is very true for me personally. So, like, I just, like, it gives me kind of, like, a little insight of what your personality could look like. But sure. obviously, I would give you the chance to, like, you know, indulge me in who you really are. That's cool. Okay, thank you. Let's head on back. Okay, so we do have two guys. Cowboy, left. I want to hear go him. Go ahead and see if you guys have any questions for her. You do? Okay, let's start here. Uh, what is submission to you? Submission. What is being a submissive woman? Uh, cut. Submissive him asking that question. Is... Hold on, I, I'm, not, I'm not gonna keep on pausing too much, but him him asking that question is wild because of what he does. He's in an adult industry joint. Him, that's a wild question for him because he's trying to figure out something, something different. I, it sound like to me. Yes like allowing my man to lead so like um let's say like let's say we want to buy a house or something yeah. and i want to live in one area but you tell me that you want to live in this area for this that and this reason i'm going to listen to you and if i feel like okay my man has proved to me that he can lead i think he knows what he's talking about if we move here it might not be the best idea so i'm gonna go with what my man says what do you mean prove to you um just like Letting me know that you have, like, you know what you're doing, basically. Just, like, financially, spiritually, mentally, what's your goals. If you say that you have goals and you haven't achieved any of them, then why would I let you lead anything that has to do with me? So just proving it that way. Okay. Good. Okay. Any questions here? What city you stay? I mean, where you stay? <laughs> I stay in Phoenix. You said what city? Yes, what, what what city I'm you stay in Cali, at? So I don't know. Ooh. Long distance. Long distance. I don't know about that one. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So long distance is no for you. No, I okay. I can't do that. Okay. So you did have him get his balloon back. Is he someone that you're tight? He's handsome. Yeah. I would I would entertain him. Okay. Oh, entertain me. Hold on. I would. <laughs> Hold on. I would. Uh, did I say something bad? You said entertain. Yeah. Entertain mean? the idea of getting to know you. Okay. Just like you would do that for me, Bank. I feel you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back this way. Why did we end up popping? The judge I had to think about what she was saying about the submission. So before I got famous, before I had anything, I had my ex of uh, three years. I was trying to marry and stuff like that, but she didn't believe in the hustle. She didn't believe what I was doing and stuff like that. I didn't have the results. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying with that? And she didn't believe in what was happening and I told her what exactly was going to happen mm -hmm. to where I am today and stuff like that. It's like, okay, I can't entrust that. Oh, I might not have it in five years. I might have it in two years. It might happen in six years. You feel me? But like you thinking that, oh, you don't have the results yet. You know, a lot of people don't have results yet. You feel me type of shit? It don't come overnight. It don't come over in a year. It don't come over in three. Mm -hmm. You got to stick and ride. If you ain't, and if you're not going to do that, I... okay. beat it. That right? sound effect yeah. was a little crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I felt that. All right, well, Nucci, that is all the balloons popped, but we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Look at them. Every, people, everybody biting their lip. <laughs>